One area getting a lot of attention in blockchain right now is campaign finance and campaign donations. There's some really interesting and compelling use cases, ways that we might be able to use blockchain to do new and innovative things around campaign finance that just aren't practical or feasible today. Let's say that I'm running for office and you want to support my campaign. Well, today you might write me a thousand dollar check and I get all 1,000 of those dollars right away to use for my campaign. Maybe we want to use blockchain to empower voters to keep their politicians more accountable to the promises they make on the campaign trail. Consider the following scenario. Let's say that instead of donating $1,000 to my campaign, you write a smart contract on the blockchain to manage campaign donations. You give that smart contract $1,000 instead. That smart contract has been programmed with the terms and conditions under which it is able to release those funds to my campaign. I might get $250 of that thousand initially to use for my election. If I get elected, the remaining $750 can stay in the smart contract, otherwise it gets refunded to you. Let's say I do get elected. Perhaps I don't get the second 250 of that thousand dollars until a year in office if I've fulfilled three or more of my campaign trail promises. And then we might say as a final step, I get the remaining $500 to use for my re-election only if I fulfilled 80% or more of my campaign promises during my first four-year term in office. This would put a lot of power back in the hands of voters and would keep politicians accountable for the promises they make long after Election Day. While things like this certainly are possible with conventional technology, they're not very practical or feasible. Blockchain and smart contracts puts this power back in the hands of voters and has the potential to radically reform campaign finance and campaign donations.